Hey guys, we're continuing our uh, trek down putting in a native garden this year at our Johnson County Extension Master Gardener demonstration garden called the Garden Gallery. And on this episode, I want to focus on how you're going to get your plants. You basically have two choices for plants. One is they're going to come from seed or you're going to buy a plant that's already growing and planted. And here's kind of the pros and cons. The advantage to seed is it's less expensive to establish an area. The major con to plants is it more expensive. But here's the other difference. For a seeded prairie native planting, it's probably gonna take about three years for those seedlings to mature enough that you really have a native garden that you might be searching for. The advantage of those plants are almost in one or two seasons, those plants are gonna establish much quicker. So I think when it comes to whether you use seeds or you use plants, I think it comes down to a couple things. What's your budget? How long do you want to wait on a return? And then of course, how big is the area? For most Johnson County kind of backyard people that are putting in small native plantings for butterflies, wildlife, the bees, I think your best bet is to go with plants. Small plants that can be purchased at a number of different outlets around the Kansas City area. Because then you can put the plant species you want in the spot you want it to be in instead of taking your chances where that plant's going to randomly land in a seed mix. So your choices are seeds or plants. For a thousand square foot or so smaller garden, I think your best bet's going to go with those plant materials. Plants give you that advantage of a jump on growth and establishment and takes the guesswork out of what's coming up where. Either way works fine, it's just a little bit more work to establish a garden from seeds as it is from plants. So choose what's best for you and enjoy.